hey guys welcome back again in my previous video tutorial i have shown you how you can convert your english excel file data to the csv file the comma separated file and i have also shown you that how you can change the comma with the pipeline delimiter but many of us are facing the problem with the other language data let's say how you can convert this type of uh, the data which is not in the language english if it is in the other language then how you can convert that data into the csv file with the comma or the pipeline delimiter separated so here is the one chinese data that uh, i have right now so just select that particular data the data that you want to convert now go into the file go into the save as section and then after just select from this particular option the save as type options go into the unique code text format that is what the dot txt file so go into the txt format unicode text give it a particular name let's say the temp chinese so that is what the temporary chinese data conversion and just click on the save it will ask you to this uh, selected file does not uh, support the workbooks that contain the multiple it select just the ok then it will open that in this particular format .txt but it is not supported over here so and just may contain the features that are not just click on the yes ignore about this all the things and now just close this particular uh, file and just click on the don't save because it will override that particular data now see over here we have the txt file which is in the format the chinese format but it is in the unicode format so if you have the notepad plus plus you must have this one particularly because we are going to do some changes in that one so open that particular temp.chinese data here you can see we have the chinese data it is separated with uh, some spaces over here so what we have to do uh, here you can see the one is in the first column in our excel file and uh, this particular value is in the second column and between that one the particular space is there so keep your marker over here and keep the shift right so here just press on the control c or you can say the value in between these two values is selected just copy this value just press the control f go into the replace section here just press or paste your value over here or you can press the control v for placing this particular value over here and you can replace that with the comma or you can replace that with the pipeline delimiter so just click on the replace so as you can see over here it is replacing that particular value with the pipeline delimiter click on again the replace it will it has also replaced this particular value click on again the replace so here it is replacing this particular spaces so this way you can replace all the particular spaces in between the columns so as you can see our values are separated with the help of the pipeline delimiter now this file is in the form of the txt file just click on the alter f a so that is what the save as and click on the all files from this particular value and in the double comma give the particular name let's say the second dot csv so here i am saving my file as the second dot csv and just open that particular file this is the second dot csv file is over here just click on that one open with the notepad plus plus as you can see my file is ready with uh, the pipeline separated columns so this is how you can convert your other language data uh, first you have to convert your data into the unicode text and then you have to replace the spaces with the some whatever requirement of your separated thing the comma or the pipeline elevator so this is how you can convert your data into the csv file so thanks for watching this video and please subscribe to my channel for the other video tutorials and thank you very much